Hey Paul, what's that plant? Well Scott, this is another bamboo. This is a Philostachys. Um, Philostachys aurea, aurora, something like that, but it's koi. So Philostachys aurora koi. Um, what makes it special is uh, there's lots of Philostachys. It's a runner, um, but what makes this really special is one, you can see just the yellow and green stripes. It's really beautiful. Um, but uh, this plant is rare and really expensive. I think I got like a tiny, like one or three gallon, it was like 80 bucks. And, and it's now like five years old. You can see it's supposed to grow 10 or 15 feet. I don't, this one's never gotten more than maybe eight. Um, but what makes it so special is down here, I'll show you the, uh, they call it compressed inner nodes. So the nodes down here, you can see are compressed. And so this is a very unique structure, unique to this um, Philostachys koi bamboo and then it does have the yellow and the green stripes so it is a runner um, it is hardy I think to three degrees so temperature is not really an issue but I noticed that um, when I first planted it it almost died because it was in a really sunny spot so as you can see I moved it to this partial sun environment and it's been really happy um, I actually cut some out and tried to uh, propagate it and failed this year so I'll try it again um, but this Philostachys is great. It's expensive, hard to find, but you can see just, again, the beauty is really this um, compressed or swollen inner nodes, um, and it, that's really unique to this plant. Kind of like one we've done, Buddha's belly kind of has some unique node structure as well um, if you starve it of water. So running bamboo, as long as you're not afraid of a runner, this is a great one. Um, so give us a like, subscribe, and we'll keep them coming. Bam! Boo, koi bamboo. Uh.